So, not always, but often, if someone taps my back and I'm in turtle, he'll be like, I mean, I've done a lot of things wrong to let him get to this point, right? Okay? But my first instinct, well, not instinct, because I've got this sort of move, is to stand up, right? But how you stand up, like, you don't do this, choke me. I just rear naked is fine. Don't do that, right? We have to be more, I'm supposed to, this is called turtle position, so I'm supposed to be a turtle. So don't stick your neck out, I hide my neck. Go like this, right? So now choke me. Different, right? I'm not sticking my head out, right? So I'm going to stand up, keep going, keep going, keep going. So I stand up, here, right? I walk my hands back, so now he feels like he's falling over the top of me. You choke me? No choke, right? All good. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put one of my feet between his feet. So I move to the centre, between his leg, come back further, feet him off, and if it's Harry Potter world, right? If it's Harry Potter, I'm going to end up with an arm bar. Right? So I'm standing up. <laughs> There, yeah, so my shoulders are higher than my neck. Foot goes to the centre. This leg scoops between the feet. I come back further. I've got to watch my arm, this one here. Right? So you can pull them off if you want, over there. That was really well. That's really good. People die and expect it. Yeah? Right? There's some things that he can do. Like you can roll off me into an arm bar, but you've got to know which arm he was is, is in danger. Um, sometimes uh, they can reach down and grab your leg and like pull your leg through and get you in a weird position. Doesn't happen very often. Um, but people then, people bail. Yeah, no, most, most people try and hang on for a dear life because they feel themselves sliding off me straight away. Yeah. So like as I feel them sliding, if they're sliding towards the arm that I know they can arm bar. Then, like, well, as soon as I stand up and using this escape, my brain is paying attention to the arm that could be arm bar. Yeah, I'm in defense brain immediately. My body knows how to do the escape, so my job is to keep myself safe. So I'm like, okay, what can you do to me? What can you do to me? Yeah? And as he starts to slide, so when I do this, it's this arm here that I'm most worried about, because it's in his armpit. Yeah, so if he falls to the side, fall off to that side, see there? Look, my arm's caught in his armpit. So if, as I undo his leg, you like this, undo the other foot, look, I'm in an arm bar. Weakly go over my head. See, I don't know, you could leave it there. Yeah, right? That arm's in danger the whole time, because it's the one near his armpit, do you remember? So, that's the one I'm most concerned about. Right. So when he's up here, I lose this, and I start pulling the back one. Right. And if I if I get here, like the arm that was on my arm that now could work against him because I can get hold of that. Start lifting him and possibly do that. I've never armed anyone coming out of it, but I've seen Instagram videos where guys do it, so it's possible. Yeah. 